Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome to Sunday Morning Front Porch Story and Coffee Time. Today is a great day. It's the Feast of the Epiphany. So the Magi were seekers, and look where it led them. They kept focused. So I suppose for today, it's a time to reflect upon what or whom do we seek, and is it worth it? So an epiphany often we refer to as an aha moment, a surprise moment. So hopefully uh, you will have some of those today and throughout this new year. My cup today is um, you are my sunshine. Okay, so that's a lovely thought. Uh, Jesus is a sunshine for many. And I hope he is for you too. All right, so today's story has totally nothing to do with the epiphany, as usual. Okay. Miss Beatrice, the church organist, was in her 80s and had never been married. She was admired for sweetness and kindness to all. One afternoon, the pastor came to call on her, and she showed him into her quaint little sitting room. She invited him to have a seat while she prepared tea. As he sat facing her old pump organ, the young minister noticed a beautiful cut glass bowl filled with water and something floating on top of it. In the water floated above all things a condom. When she returned with tea and scones, they began to chat. The pastor tried to stifle his curiosity about the bowl of water and its strange floater, but soon it got the better of him and he could no longer resist. Miss Beatrice, he said, I wonder if you could tell me about this, pointing to the bowl. Oh, yes, she replied. Isn't it wonderful? I was walking through the park a few months ago, and I found this little package on the ground. The direction said to place it on the organ, keep it wet, and that it would prevent the spread of disease. And guess what? I haven't had the flu all winter. So the pastor fainted. Wasn't very seasoned. All righty, everybody. So be open to that element of surprise and aha moments uh, that give you a sense of peace and love that the mystery of the epiphany, again, that um, the Magi were seeking something worthwhile. They were driven. And so seek that within you, because that is where God is to be found. Have a good day.